Hey guys, Tony Weeks here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to, well, basically, where is it? Basically, do something like this, where you can get access to anyone's code um, on Steam, like say a. Let's just go to Steam. A workshop like map. So say if you go to workshop, let's let's do so simple. How big is this? Oh, it's not too big. Um, well, I'll be back, guys, once this is downloaded. Well, basically, guys, what I'm showing you is how to get the code from any map. So if I, like, I can show you, like, I don't know if this is, we well, got Reagan Mark 2 looking at it, so I can see the code on how it got Reagan and that into it, and everything really, it's really custom code. A custom damage range for controller support, reimagined easter egg, so basically you can even get the easter eggs. And everything that's in this map. I'll be back guys once it's finished downloading. Oh and guys I'm going to leave a link to this down in the description. Because you're going to need this. Um, to view everything. There we go guys, now it's done. Um, I don't even need to run the game, I could literally just go to, basically go to uh, where your Steam um, Steam library, no not Steam library, where your Steam folder is, yours will probably be on your C drive or wherever, one's on my F, go to Steam apps, go to workshop, um, content, and then I know it's called Black Ops 3 because it's just downloaded right now, so it's that one. And then I just do date modified if you want the latest one, and then it'll be the top one. See, it's under cold storage. That's it. If I view the icons for it, guys, that's this, that's that, and that's the loading image. And what you do is, guys, you go to zm underscore whatever the map name is dot ff. You open up you open up this. Uh, basically, you drag and drop the ff file into that, and it'll process it. This works for Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3. So you get that's done, press enter. Now if I go to the UI version, open, go to games, where did I put it, the touch. No wait, you want extracted, Black Ops 3 or whatever game it, scripts, ZM, then just go down till you find it. You probably won't have as many as I have. Right, it's on the. Oh no, I see it. Oh, wait. Okay, right. It's on the shared. No. Is it process? Is it the process? Black Ops 3 scripts. ZM. No. So where did it go? Right. 
extracted scripts, Black Ops 3 scripts. Okay, this is all just now cold storage here. Okay, I found it. So it was in extracted strips. I just gotta find it. There's cold storage. There we are. And then you got the CSC and GSC. Just copy them both, press open, and then you'll get it all pop up. You got the decompiled. It's not a big script, this one actually. It's pretty small. Is there a lot in the CSC though? Not really. And basically, you've got all like your functions and stuff. If you just press save and save, and then if you go to your process, Black Ops 3 scripts, ZM, you've got the cold storage decompiled. CSC and the GSC and then like I say you've got to sort the functions and stuff yourself um, but he's even got the WJP gaming because he's own to add a th like that to his own player score You've got voice lines, the max ammo function, officer friendly, zombie cell breaker. I'm not sure what that is, but I've got. You can do this with anything on the workshop, because I've got uh, ice grenades. I decompiled ice grenades here. And that's all of this. And I've been working on my own lab using some of his code. He knows about it and everything. But yeah. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this quick video. If you have, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace.